It's time for baseball on MLB Ladies Network. Should be a good one here this afternoon between the Pittsburgh Pirates and the St. Louis Cardinals. So stepping in, Josh Bell. He will lead this one off today. Now here it comes. Ooh, he saws him off with that one. And a long throw across the diamond gets him. That's a nice play. Digging in now, Adam Frazier. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Temperature about what you'd expect for this time of year. 56 degrees at first pitch. There's a swing and a high deep drive headed for the right field corner. And that's going to wind up hooking just a bit foul. So a missed opportunity there. Two and two to Adam Frazier. Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. Digging in, the Jacob catch. Stallings. Bases are empty here with two men out. Nope. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. That's ball three and one. I got three and one. Three balls, one strike. Fastball is taken for a strike, and he runs it full three and two. Great job of doubling up with the fastball inside. A lot of times you'll see a pitcher go in there, but they won't go back in there a second time. This guy's not afraid to pitch inside. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Coming to the plate now, Paul Goldschmidt. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. lay off the curveball that's in the dirt that time and it's back to even now at two and two swung on and miss really fooled him that time for the first out at the plate Colton Wong as he'll get his first opportunity in this one fouled off bases are empty one man out and another foul ball A great pitch there as he couldn't get extended on that one and he's down on strikes for the second out. So digging in now, Paul DeYoung looking to get on base and keep this first inning alive. Who jumped the gun a bit on that swing and he's down one and two. Going to be a long day if he executes like this, punching tickets right out of the gate. Turned on that one and crushed it, just pulled it a little foul. Again, a one-two. And he tries to get him to reach for it, but it stays outside three and two. Boy, not what you want coming out of the gate as a pitcher, right? You don't want to have to show all of your pitches this early on in the game. And the throw to first is there. The inning is over. So here's the cleanup hitter, Brian Reynolds. He'll get us started in the top of the second. Fouled away. The one two. Swung on in the dirt for the third strike. Molina gathers and he makes the throw to first. Reynolds is retired and there's one away. The court foul. Stepping up to the plate, Kevin Newman. 1-1. One, one. Hit on the ground out to short. Throw on to first, two gone. So bases are empty here with two gone. And into bat next, the speedy Gerard Dyson. The one and two pitch. Lifted in the air out to right. On the move is Fowler. 
He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. Last half of the second set to go, and next to hit is the catcher, Yadier Molina. And a slider. Oh, got a favorable call on that one as that's the that first out of the inning. The center fielder. Into the box Harrison. now, Harrison Bader. Bader. The 3 1. Still looking for our first hit in the ballgame. Now a swing and a fly ball. And foul. Something has to give. Here's the payoff pitch. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Reynolds will get there with ease as he puts it away for out number two. So that bases are empty here with two the gone. And that'll bring up the sweet swinging Matt Carpenter. 1-1. Pulled toward right center field. Dyson's there. And the inning is over. New inning set to get underway. And set to go is the third baseman, Colin Moran. And he fouls this one off. Ball two. Ball two. Well, two straight fastballs inside haven't put him away, so now it'll be interesting to see what he turns to. And it's fouled away. Hit hard to the right. Foul. Another try at 2 2. Well hit to right, but a foul ball. Locked in a good battle. Here comes another one. Hit hard down the line. But a foul ball as it holds it two and two. Here it comes. Hey, five foul balls in a row. Loving the battle in the box right here. Making the pitcher work. And he finally puts him away here as he strikes him out after an 11 pitch at bat. The right now with the plate, John Ryan Murphy. John Ryan. 1-1. Uh, one, one. Both teams so far yet to crack the hit column. Swung on, and he went fishing in the dirt. Molina has it, and he makes the throw to first. Murphy is retired, two down now. So bases are empty here with two gone. And that'll bring up the San Diego area native pitcher Joe Musgrove. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Two and two the count. Not surprised he's laid on a heater right there. Just saw an off-speed pitch. Wanted to stay back a little bit too long. Now a swing and he pops it foul behind the plate. And he'll lunge out of the crouch to put this one away. Good reactions there and the inning is over. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And into bat next will be Tyler O'Neill. The 1-1. One -one. Down the left field line and deep. And this will not be caught. It's a foul ball. The one two. Drilled to the left side. And that's the first hit in this one for the Redbirds. At the plate, Dexter Fowler. Fowler behind a ball and two strikes. O'Neill aboard here at first with nobody out. Outside and low that time. Now it's two balls and two strikes. And that's low, so a good eye there as he works the count back full. Got to believe that runner from first is going to be in motion, especially in this situation. As an offensive player, just hit something hard because those defenders are going to be moving. 
batting ninth. Coming to the plate now, Jack Flaherty. And he could give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. And no surprise to see the pitcher squaring around as he gets this one down. Over to Bell for the double play. So it's back to the top of the order now. And stepping in, the power hitting first baseman, Paul Goldschmidt. Goldschmidt. The set and the two and one. And this is on the inside edge, perhaps off the inside edge, but it's a called strike two and two now. Rip down the line. But this is going to be a foul ball as that keeps things at two and two. Even at two and two. The pitch. Colton Wong would be next. And strike three called as he says, you got to be kidding me with the side retired. So that'll bring up Josh Bell. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. The 1-1 one, one home. Still all zeros in the run column here in the fourth inning. Dan, does this continue or does somebody score here? Oh, you have to love. You know, Matt, we have so many of these games that are 12 to 10 and 9 to 8. It's nice to see a low-scoring pitcher's duel for once. Now batting the second baseman, Adam Frazier. In now, Adam Frazier. Now a slider well off the plate. An easy take there. Not a time to fool around right now on a 3-2 count with the middle part of the order coming up. Expect a good pitch to swing at. Here's a little chopper up the middle. Wong for one. Return throw is in time. And what do you know? They do get the double play. So base is empty now after the double play. And now it will be the catcher, Jacob Stallings. Now the one and one pitch. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. O'Neal looks up. Gone! Into the box now, Brian Reynolds. This is line to left. O'Neal is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And that'll bring up Colton Wong. Now the payoff pitch home. Is put in play to the right side of the infield. And an off-balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow! Stepping in and ready for another shot, Paul DeYoung. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. And now a slider in there for a called third strike, and there are two gone now. So bases are empty here with two gone, and here now is the catcher, Yadier Molina. In the air to straightaway right. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. Ready for another chance? Kevin Newman. He'll start off the fifth in this one. Into the windup. Here's the two and one pitch. Back up the middle. And a base hit, so the leadoff man is on to begin the inning. The center fielder, number six, Gerard. Into the box, Gerard Dyson. Left side, but well foul. The one two. He is swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. Ready now, Colin Moran. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see if he tries to cheat to something this A.B. Fouled off. The 1-2. 
And this one's in the dirt, but it won't skip away far enough for the runner to advance. A two and two count. Here's the pitch. Popped him up. DeYoung has a play. Two gone. Stepping into the box, John Ryan Murphy looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at bat. Looked like the fastball got away from him there. It's ball two. That's a great call right there. Fastball away with a guy who's got some jets on first base. Almost like a hybrid pitch out. Great for a catcher if that guy's running. Easy transfer throw to second base. And the count will be full. Good spot for an RBI. Put the ball in play with the runner in motion. He could score all the way from first. Fouled away. Another full count pitch home. And he rolls over this one foul. We'll do it once more. Three and two. Another full count pitch home. And he fouls this one off. And that misses ball four. So it's first and second now with two out. So here now is the pitcher, Joe Musgrove. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Ready with the 1-1. One, one. No contact there, and it's 1-2. One and two. Hey, I know it's the pitcher at the plate, but he's going to grind it out right here. He's got a chance to help himself. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. Bottom of the inning now, and into bat next, one of the fastest players in all of baseball, Harrison Bader. And it's fouled away. Here now the 2 2. There's a swing and a high drive into left center field. Ranging back is Dyson at the track. The wall. And it's gone. To the plate now, Matt Carpenter. Can't keep the weight back, and he falls behind one and two. And the pitch. Off the plate that time and a little high. It's even at two and two. Shin high fastball that time. Ball three. Full count here. Here comes the pitch. And there's a base hit on the line. The back. No one here. So now to the plate, Tyler O'Neill. One and two now as that one's fouled off. Hit hard on the ground towards second. To second for one. On to first, and they get the double play. Into the box, Dexter Fowler. He drew a walk his first time up. Both clubs with three hits in the ballgame. And there's ball two now. And I believe they'll say he broke the plane as yes he did. It's ruled a strike. Still hanging with him. Another good swing to keep it going. Back up the middle. Newman fields it cleanly. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as this side is retired. Ready for another shot now. Josh Bell. He'll lead things off here in the Pirates' half of the sixth. From the windup, the 1-1 one -one pitch. Swung on and missed. One and two now. Really feels like he's just on cruise control out there on the mound right now. Boy, this is a tight one. You kind of get the feeling like the next team that scores is going to win this one. 
The 2-2. Two -two. Now Bell swings and launches one to right. Gone to lead off the inning. Standing in now, Adam Frazier. And he finds a way to catch the zone here. It's one and two. And he'll lay off the curveball that's in the dirt that time, and it's back to even now at two and two. Swing and a miss as he ran the fastball right by him for the first down. At the plate, Jacob Stallings is coming off a solo homer in his previous trip. The 1-1 one, one home. Good slider there. Gets a swing and miss. Lifted in the air out towards left center. After it is O'Neal. He tracks it down and makes the play to record the second out. Up next for the Buckos, Brian Reynolds. He'll swing it from the left side right here. More of a comfortable side from the left side. Puts the ball in play. More of a contact hitter from the left side. Might have grown up being a natural left-handed hitter. Full count, three and two. Hit on the ground to third. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Tommy Edmond is going to come off the bench as he'll be asked to lead off the bottom of inning number six. Tommy Edmond. Now a swing and he gets him to pop it up. And this will land foul. Here now the 2-2. He swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. Here's Paul Goldschmidt now. 0 for 2 on the afternoon so far. The 1-1. Goldschmidt swings and hits this one very well out to deep left field. Gone! Davidas Nevoroskis is out from the bullpen now as he'll make his first appearance here on the season. At the plate, Colton Wong. And he popped him up. Here's Reynolds moving forward on it, but he won't get there. It falls in. The batter number 11. Good job. Paul DeYoung. Stepping in now, Paul DeYoung. And he pumps the fastball by him here. One and two now. I can't imagine he was sitting on fastball at his neck right there. He is going to have to lower his sights if he's going to have any chance. The one-two pitch. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. So you'd love for him to offer at that one, but the execution was flawless. Nice curveball that starts in the zone and breaks just out. Just a great take by the batter. Dyson calls off the left fielder as he takes charge for the second out. So it's a runner at first now with two out. men out. And here now is the catcher, Yadier Molina. Molina. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. Hit on the ground out to short. Newman's got it. Go on to Bell at first, and the side is retired. Tyler Webb is on the pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number 30. So striding forward now, Kevin Newman, one for two. He grounded out first time up and followed that with a base hit. And he gets him to pop it up on the right side of the infield. And Goldschmidt able to put the squeeze on it here, one away. 
stepping in, Gerard Dyson. He struck out swinging in his last trip to the plate. A one and one count. Here's the pitch. Hey. Swing and a miss for out number two and a ball he had no chance of making contact with. Digging in once again, Colin Moran. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. Just off the inside part of the plate, it's 3 and 1. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters, so you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. Taken in by Goldschmidt, and he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. He's one for two in this one. And going back to that previous at-bat when he hit the two-strike breaking ball for a home run, something tells me that this guy, when he gets behind in the count, sits on something off-speed or the breaking ball. Count is one and two now. Now here's the pitch. And he popped him up. Back into foul territory behind first. And no one can get there. He'll try it again. Rounded back up the middle. And that'll get through into center. So there's your possible go-ahead run on base now to lead off the inning. In now, Matt Carpenter. Lifted down the line in left. Left fielder is on the move, but this will land untouched. Here's the 2-2. Now here's a line drive, and this is going to get down for extra bases. Here comes the go-ahead run. Now the relay home. He's safe at the plate. And they've taken the lead here in the seventh. Now back, left fielder, Tyler O'Neal. Into the box now, Tyler O'Neal. Rounded down the third baseline, but a foul ball, one and two now. As a look, now the pitch. Three runs, seven hits, and no errors so far for the Redbirds. Hit back up the middle. He's got it. And there's one down now. Here's Dexter Fowler now. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Dexter Fowler. Two balls and a strike. Man, he just missed the zone right there. One of the toughest pitches in the game, that backdoor cutter. As an offensive player, you give up on that pitch. As soon as it comes out of the hand, next thing you know, it's trying to grab the corner. Three and one to him now. Hitters count all the way. Here it comes. Bouncer to the left side. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. Throw in time at first for route number two. Ron Hill Rebello will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Number 47. Well above the letters with the fastball that time. For the guy in the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy. He's thrown a bunch of pitches, and this A.B. hasn't been any different. Definitely laboring at the moment. And he lays off, ball four. So he comes right off the bench and works the walk. Usually easier said than done. Big spot here. Runners at the corners, two gone. And that'll bring up the big bat of Paul Goldschmidt. Number 57. Now playing center and batting nine. Line towards center field. Martin is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. Andrew Miller has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Andrew 
Jose Osuna. Well, pinch hit here, and he's the potential tying run. Jose Osuna. And the slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. Three and one. Down by a run, your guy needs to get on any way he can. His mentality has to be to shrink the strike zone to like the size of a soup can. No reason to swing at a pitcher's pitch. And he lays off ball four. So now the potential now tying run here is aboard late in the game. Striding in, Jason Martin. And he's getting his first plate appearance here in the eighth after entering off the bench just a little bit ago. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. And that's high for a ball. It's two and two. Hot shot down the line. And a reach with the backhand, but he comes up empty as that gets by him. Now that the first baseman. Into the box, Josh Bell fouled off. This is swung on and missed, and boy, they took care of a key man there. One away. The second so striding in, Adam, Adam Frazier, as Frazier. he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. To two balls and two strikes now. Struck him out. Struck him out again, I should say. His third punch out of the game. John Gant enters the ball game out of the pen, looking for the final out here in the top of inning number eight. Jacob Stallings will be his first assignment here as he'll face him with runners at first and second and two away. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Down low, two balls and a strike. A time to start making some quality pitches. He finds himself in a tough spot behind an account with guys on base. Slow roller down the third baseline. Throw on to first is in time, and that snuffs out the Bucko rally as the inning is over. Colton Wong will stand in. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. Counts even at two and two to Wong. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. Ready with another 2 2. Swing and a looper to left. Here's Reynolds moving forward on it. He can't get to it. This one's down. The batter number 11. Good Paul DeYoung. To the plate now, Paul DeYoung. There's a well hit ball out to right center field. And a big insurance run comes around to score from first. It's four to two. Catcher number four. Yadier. At the plate now, Yadier Molina. And this pitch misses for a ball. Two and one now to Molina. Somebody's getting frustrated. He's not used to getting hit around like this. To short. Newman brings it in. And there's one away. Digging in and looking for more, Harrison Bader. He went deep back in the fifth. He set and the 2 1 pitch. And ooh, that strike zone's getting a little inconsistent now. It's 2 and 2. And they're working the outer half here, but that one's wide for ball three. Fouled away. Ah. 
Fastball, strike three called as he couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. The third baseman, so a runner at second, two down now, Matt. and that brings up Matt Carpenter. Carpenter. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. High in the air down the right field line. But this will wind up being a foul ball. And a pitch down that swung on and sent to second base. They'll whip this one to first in time, and that ends the inning. Your Jeffrey Lynx takes the ball now, now in inning number nine, looking to close the door. Well, Jeffrey. All set for the start of the inning, and set to go is the switch hitting outfielder, Brian Reynolds. Looking for base runners here as they're down two playing on the road. Not an easy thing to do trying to score runs or bunch hits together off of a closer. And that's in there. Base hit. Now that Kevin. Standing in now, Newman. Kevin Newman. Couldn't lay off that time, and it's one and two. Lynx, once a member of the Cardinals organization, he became a member of this team after signing as a free agent earlier this season. Yeah, he didn't have an opportunity to really get acclimated to this ball club. Showing up during the season is not always easy, opening the doors to a big league clubhouse and trying to get to know your teammates. The best way to get to know them is to go out and produce. Swing and a miss as he pulled the string on him. One and two. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. Hey, he threw that pitch with a purpose to get a double play. Good job to let it go by, though, as a hitter. Liner toward right center. In there, a base hit. Now batter. Third base hit. Colin. Stepping in now, Colin Moran misses ball two. Hey, this isn't going to be an easy save. These guys are making it work for this one. Tried to fool him with the changeup, but he won't offer at it. Three and two. I don't think he can afford another base runner here, so whatever pitch he feels best about, whichever one he feels most comfortable with, that's the one I expect him to turn to. Bader is there now, and he has it. Two gone. Digging in, Cole Tucker he comes to the plate as the last chance for his side. Two out here in the ninth. Pittsburgh down to their last strike. Shin high, that's taken for a ball. A crowd of over 39,000 on their feet. And he struck him out for out number three. So that'll wrap things up here as they leave the possible tying run stranded at first. And a nice job here to come in and slam the door. That's his first save of the season, but it certainly won't be his last. Four to two, the final score today. The Cardinals jumped ahead in the seventh inning and never gave the lead back. Tyler Webb claims the win out of the pen, his first. Jeffrey Lynx hammers down the save, his first of the year. So that's a wrap for us in this one. Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, Matt Vaskersian, we all thank you for watching Major League Baseball on MLB Network. See you next time.